We present SampleNet, a differentiable point cloud sampling method. Nowadays, there is a variety of tasks that operate directly on point clouds. As the size of the point cloud grows, so do the computational demands of these tasks. A possible solution is to sample the point cloud first. The question is how to select the data points. We propose a learned sampling approach that is optimized to a downstream task. Indeed, Different points are selected for different tasks. What happens if we do not use our method? Let's see an example for reconstructing a point cloud from its samples. As a reference result, the point cloud is reconstructed from the complete input. An intuitive strategy would be farthest point sampling, which samples the point cloud uniformly. However, it might not sample points that are important for the reconstruction task and can lead to significant detail loss. Our method, on the other hand, can learn to select the points that contribute the most to the task and thus better preserve the input shape. For illustration purpose, we explain our method with a simple example where the blue points represent the input point cloud. At first, we produce a simplified version of the input denoted with red points. That is a smaller set of points in the ambient space, which are not guaranteed to be a subset of the original points. We are interested in sampling, meaning selecting points from the input. However, the sampling operation is non-differentiable. Since it's like a step function, either a point is sampled or not. The question is how to learn a sampling model in a differentiable manner. This brings us to the main contribution of our work. We propose a novel differentiable relaxation for sampling in the form of soft projection operation. A simplified point Q, illustrated in red, is softly projected onto its local neighborhood from the primary point cloud, illustrated as blue points, meaning it is replaced by a weighted sum of its nearest neighbors from the input, resulting in the magenta point R. The projection weights are determined by the distance to the neighbors and a temperature coefficient. As the temperature goes to zero, the weight distribution becomes closer to a delta function, which approximates the selection of a point from the input. The soft projection operation is introduced during training and the temperature coefficient is minimized. Thus, our method learns an optimal sampling strategy for a downstream task and outperforms other methods. Our approach is applied to several applications. For point cloud classification, we evaluate the instance classification accuracy of the official test split of model net 40 for different sampling ratios and methods. The x-axis is the sampling ratio in log 2 scale, and the y-axis is the accuracy percentage. Sample net outperforms the other methods by a large margin. For example, at sampling ratio 32, which is only 3% of the input data, it achieves an improvement of 20%. This shows our sampling method learned to select discriminative points for the classification task. The registration application introduces a new challenge. Since sampling should be consistent across two different point clouds for a shared downstream task, for visualization purpose, the template shape is presented as CAD model and the source shape is presented with blue points. The sampled points for the source and template are illustrated in magenta and orange respectively. While FPS results in noticeable error, our sampled points are consistent and gives a much more accurate result. To summarize, we propose a learned sampling approach for point clouds that takes into account the objective of a subsequent task. We present a differentiable relaxation to the sampling operation, which enables to approximate it during training. Our learned sampling achieves better results than alternative sampling methods. It is flexible and can be applied for various tasks. Our code is publicly available. Please see our paper for more details. Thank you.